Hi guys, hope you all are doing great. Today I am going to review another set of lipsticks and these lipsticks are very close to my heart because I really really like them and uh, the fact that there are so many beautiful shades for uh, deeper duskier skin tone makes me really really happy and it's one of uh, one of the vegan and cruelty free brands available out there and we have this guys cosmetics liquid lipsticks today. So, the brand has sent me all the lipsticks, though this video is not uh, sponsored. There is a difference between PR, sent samples and sponsored video. So I'm going to share whatever I really think about these lipsticks and why do I like them and if there is any con. So let's just start the video. These are Disguise Featherlight Matte Liquid Lip Creams. That's a mouthful. So I have I received these sometime uh, last month. I think in the beginning of the month and uh, ever since I'm testing out these lipsticks and trying them I've already posted a couple of stories on my Instagram if you're not following me on Instagram please do so because I do a lot of post a lot of uh, short reviews do a lot of unboxing there so uh, these lipsticks are priced at to be 700 each and there are eight shades and all the shades are very deeper skin tone friendly uh, I, I hope you know you guys understand what I'm trying to say here so there are a lot of shades that are really really beautiful. I have been testing these out for more than a month now and what I love the most about these lipsticks is that these are uh, matte liquid lipsticks but they are not overly drying or uh, patchy on the left. The formula is really nice and opaque. The steak power is good 7 plus hours on me. After eating meals or after eating greasy food there will be slight fading from the center of the lips and that's what happens with most of the liquid lipsticks. Your liquid lipstick fades from the middle of your lips from the center of your lips and uh, that's all. So these lipsticks are vegan and cruelty free if you are wondering and I really like the formula here. So let's start with the swatches. First one we have number 30 pretty nude. So pretty nude is pretty nude for me. I mean, this is like a pinkish pale nude. The formula here will give you medium finish in one go. You can layer it up, you will get full coverage. So the shade will be more suitable for people with fair to medium skin tones. I mean, it's it's working out pretty well for me as well, but I don't prefer such muted uh, lighter colors on me. It makes me look sick. So the only dislike I have uh, observed is the wand. I think it's a bit too long and uh, I struggle when I put lipstick on to get a precise application. However, you will get a hang of it. So then we have number 31 relaxed mocha which is one of my favorite shades from this range. In fact, this is my favorite everyday shade these days. So these lipsticks do not feel uh, thick when you apply them. In fact, these two have slightly oily slick to them. But that doesn't affect the staying power of these. These stay on for a really long time. But yes, because of that oil kind of formula, it feels really comfortable on the lips. It doesn't emphasize the texture and lines on your lips. This is a relaxed mocha. This is my favorite shade from all the colors I'm going to swatch today. It's such a beautiful everyday color for people of my skin tone or darker than me. This is like a beautiful brown. It has. Next we have number 32 Nostalgic Rose. Which is like a rosy mauve color. So this is Nostalgic Rose. It's a very very beautiful dusty mauve pink. It's the kind of color. I love and this is like my second favorite from the range it's very beautiful it's very wearable if you are into pinky everyday color then this is like a must-have and uh, I think that this color is going to look good on all skin tones but especially if you are of my complexion this is going to look really nice subtle everyday color very beautiful number 33 is naughty magenta it's more like a purple very beautiful shade So 
This is the color. It's very very beautiful. This is like my kind of color. Very pretty. Uh, very purple. You can. This looks very beautiful. And when you smack your lips, it doesn't crumble. So which is amazing. And it dries down like immediately. I'm talking to you, and it has dried down already. Very comfortable. Very beautiful. Next we have number 34 excited coral which indeed looks like a coral red to me a variable but really bright coral let's see how it looks on the lips This is excited coral it looks pretty exciting and it's pretty bold this color is very bright not my kind of shade but if you are into coral and if you are into brighter color then this is really good it brightened up my complexion and it's a color that you will apply and you will feel really good and happy about the day the color is very beautiful and uh, yeah. next we have inspired red which looks like a darker more brown tone red Color is beautiful and it will complement all skin tones. Next up, we have Curious Wine. The good thing about the applicator is that it's pretty saturated whenever it comes out, so you don't really have to go back again and again. And it's very soft, it's not like a stiff uh, doe foot applicator. It has this hole in, in the middle that fills up when, when it comes out of the tube. It's a very beautiful dark wine color. The last shade is number 37. Fabulous Espresso. This is Fabulous Espresso. It's a very deep dark brown. Uh, but it's not you know, full coverage. It's very sheer. So you have to layer it up two times thrice to get a nice opaque dark lip. So those were all the shades from Disguise Cosmetics Liquid Lip Cream Collection and uh, I would highly recommend you guys to go out and check these lipsticks. These are very long staying, very comfortable on the lips. These are 100% vegan, cruelty free. These do not have parabens or lead in there which is amazing. So these are my two favorite shades from this range which is Relax Mocha and Nostalgic Rose. Apart from this, I really like Naughty Magenta and Inspired Red. So these four are my favorite shades from this range. I will leave the link of these lipsticks in the description box below. If you are interested, you can check them out, you can buy them. If you are watching me for the first time, please subscribe to my channel and I will see you very, very soon in my next video.